Welcome back. YCN Sports Talk. Jeremy Stout, Andrew Zerheide, and it's almost baseball season. Basically, two and a half weeks. That first Monday right. in, in April uh, is opening day. Red Sox open up at Fenway Park. It's going to be cold if the yep. forecast is any indication right. in the snow we have out there right now. Let's get into the David Price situation. Mm -hmm. When the injury happened a couple weeks ago or whenever it was, they said he had a second opinion, second MRI. It yep. looked fine, but the, mm -hmm. the rest, recovery. Nobody ever really believed it was 7 to 10 days rest. It always looked like right. it was something more. But now it appears he may not start the season. He may start on the DL. Should we yep. be more concerned than we are? Uh, I, think, I think we probably should be. Um, you know, I think when, uh, when this scare originally came up, uh, David Price said his elbow really was not feeling good. And right. It was feeling like if, it was a different feeling than he had ever felt before. And that's not a good sign. Um, but, you know, with, this, with Tommy John, it's kind of a weird thing. So if, if a pitcher needs Tommy John, you really want to get that surgery done right. immediately. Right. You don't want to wait around because it takes more than a year to, typically to come back from it. So... You know, I think if there's a question of if he needs it or not, I think he should get it done right now. Right. So he comes back as soon as possible for next season. But, I mean, I, I think there is some concern. You know, it's a question of do you want him to be okay this season? You know, not pitching to the best of his ability, kind of favoring that arm? Or do you want him to just go down for the year and right. be 100% for next well, season? Well, that's the thing. A good point that you bring up is... What if it comes up in June, right? And then he gets the surgery. Then, yep. then you've lo you've lost him for 2018 right. as well. So yep. you've lost him for 2017, basically, if mm -hmm. if he's hurt halfway through the season. Yep. And you lose him for all of next year because it takes over a year to recover. Mm -hmm. Then is he going to come back? It depends on what position they're in. Is mm -hmm. so you, you lose him for a year and a half. So I, I think you're right. I think. Sox fans are going to be concerned. I mean, obviously yep. they have Chris Sale this year, so mm -hmm. that helps. If it was Por Porcello and, and nobody else, it'd be trouble. But they yeah. have Sale. Uh, mm -hmm. Going to and a couple announcements. Porcello is going to start opening day. Yep. Any problems with that or any surprises there? Uh, no, to me it's not a surprise. I think Chris Sale is definitely a better pitcher than Rick yeah. Porcello. But uh, Porcello really earned it last year. Obviously he won the Cy Young Award. Um, but, I mean, he, he just pitched so well last year, and he's been on this team for now a couple seasons. And um, I think Sale, when he originally was traded, he even said that Porcello right. should, should start opening day because it's really, um, you know, he really earned it last year. So, to me, I think it makes sense. I think Sale is better, but Sale will start game two, and yep. it'll be fine. And, and exactly, and that's the kind of the point is, does it really matter? I right. mean, yeah, one, two, maybe in the playoffs it might matter yep. more. But yep. at this point, opening day, there's a long season to go. We're getting right. to the back end of the rotation. You've got Eduardo Rodriguez, mm -hmm. Stephen Wright, and Drew Pomerantz yep. are now going to be penciled in as three, four, and five. Is there concern right. that... You know, last year it looked like they had tons of pitching. Everyone was saying great, mm -hmm. and then they traded away Buckholz. Yep. Uh, are you concerned that these three guys to the back end of the rotation, or are they going to be okay? I mean, you can't have an ace. You can't have five aces. Right. Well, you know, it's funny. Let's say that Price is healthy. Besides those three guys, your, your four and five guys, Pomeranz and Wright, were all-stars last right. year. Right. And so, I yeah. mean, it's kind of crazy with the, the skill that they have. Um, but Pomeranz and Wright, I, th I believe it was their first all-star appearance. Yeah. So, um, you know, hopefully they can have a year just like they did last season. But, uh, you know, Erod, Eduardo Rodriguez, who will be the fifth starter, really is, I think, your insurance for Price this season. Um, but it's a little concerning. When Pomeranz came over, he really struggled. Yeah, and I he think, was injured a little bit. Right, he was dealing with some injuries. And um, Stephen Wright was, you know, lights out in the first half, and then he hurt his shoulder and really went down toward the end of the season. Um, so there's a little bit of concern. You know, they, both of those guys, Pomeranz and Wright, struggled at times. But when they were good, they were really good. So it's, right. it's probably going to be hit or miss. Yeah, and that's the thing where you have two guys at the top of your rotation, hopefully mm -hmm. three if Price is healthy. But right. at least you have the two guys... And I don't want to make a bigger deal than it is because mm -hmm. a three, four, and five pitcher are not going to be all stars. Right. So I understand that, but you just mm -hmm. hope that, like you said, Pomeranz can come back yep. and Wright can have another good season. Okay, so with the injury of Price, whether it's serious or not serious, mm -hmm. who can challenge in the American League East? It, basically, it looks like the Blue Jays are there, the Orioles can bounce back, yep. the Yankees are young. Probably Tampa Bay is the only team that's towards the bottom. Mm -hmm. Who? And do you think they'll challenge the Red Sox enough to win the division, or is this the Red Sox? Should, should get it in a runaway? I think the Red Sox will win the AL East, but mm. I think the Blue Jays will challenge them the most. I think their pitching is very good. Yeah. Um, 
Let's see, Aaron Sanchez, Sanchez yep. uh, Stroman. Stroman. Very good. Um, they have some very good young pitching. Lost Edwin Encarnacion from right. the offensive side, but yep. Jose Batista's back, so. Right. Yeah, their, their offense, might, they took a little bit of a hit, but their young pitching, I think, is really tops in the league, so I think the Blue Jays will get it. It's going to be a battle in the American yep. League East, and I mm -hmm. think the Red Sox do win it, I agree with you, but right. especially if Price isn't there, it's going to be a lot closer. Yep. So we got all that to look forward to a long summer. We'll take a break. When we come back, we'll get into our Valley Regional Healthcare Prescription Playbook. You're watching YCN Sports Talk.